I don't know if it's just another game. Uh, it, it's a game that you prepare for, uh, uh, you know, way back in October to um, November last year, sorry, for choosing guys with, with resilience, tough, have a, uh, uh, the ability to perform under pressure. So, uh, and also, uh, um, you know, as a coaching group, we've got to be really well prepared and we believe we've, we've got a game plan that can uh, get us through to the World Cup final. Uh, we've got uh, Anton Leonard Brown coming into centre and pushes Jack Goodhue to the wing and Mitch uh, Hunt at fullback. Yeah, a couple of days ago I got the call to come over these ways and it was pretty exciting, pretty exciting opportunity, especially to play in a World, uh, under 20 World Cup semi final. So, yeah, there's plenty of feeling and emotion and it's just mainly excitement and looking forward to the big occasion. Two rugby's a great level to be playing at and yeah I guess just the intensity and the speed and the great players that play in that uh, tournament yeah, has set me up great for this one. He's in form, he's coming back to a group of players that uh, he knows really well, he's slot straight in and he's tough and it's what we need against the French. Oh, we know our, our history with the, with the French uh, and World Cups so for us uh, we need to be really good. We need to be on the day. We need to execute, um, not give them too many opportunities. They're simple. They like to uh, kick to the corners. They maul you. They strangle you the way they play. So we've got to be really tough and, and, and tactically aware, and, and still play our band of football, uh, but uh, be smart. Yeah, or well just being with them at the Gold Coast, you know, I guess that was the, the first tournament that was massive for us and then uh, watching them play through the pool play, you know, I think they've um, come along very well and just every game they're getting better and better, so hopefully we can step it up again for the semi-final. Yeah, we've been in a tough situation, especially with the Argentina match. Uh, there's a lot of factors in play with the ref and slowing the ball down and... Uh, you know, we didn't deal with you know the rolling mall that well. A lot of the guys put their hands up and said, "Look, we could have done this better." So as a group, you know, we're taking those learnings forward, and uh, it's a one-off. You know, semi-finals are, uh, and, and test matches combination and, and tournament structure. It's a really exciting and a clear head's really key.